Miss Kisiwa. If you're new here, don't forget to click on the subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, and then come and join the family. If you're an OG, you're welcome back to the channel. So today, in fact, wait, 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 let me go back. So if you haven't realized, we are two years on YouTube, and cheers to that. <laughs> Hey okay, guys, so today I'm here to celebrate my small wins that I've, I've been. I've tried to be consistent to two years. I'm like really consistent, but I haven't given up on this YouTube thing. And I've been in it for two years. That's an achievement for me, okay? And that's a small win. And I say cheers again to that. And then I'm also going to share my journey as a YouTuber with you so far. Like, if you're a new YouTuber, if you're thinking of going into YouTube in the future, <laughs> I believe this video will be so helpful to you, okay? So, if you're ready, get seated. Just take your time, relax, and let's get into the video. Okay. So guys, first of all, I would like to share why I joined the YouTube thing in the first place, okay? So, let me say... Somewhere in 2019, I was still doing my national service. And at that time, I wasn't really, really, really busy with work stuff. So I chanced on YouTube on a video about the US lottery. And the information was applying for US lottery was for free. And that was a new thing to me because in Ghana, there are agencies that will apply for you. And if you win, they will charge you like lump sum. And for the application, I don't know if they if you pay for application. Obviously, I'm sure you're gonna pay for application. So when I had or oh, chance on this video, I'd want to like the whole world, but the whole of Ghanaians to know that applying for US lottery was for free, and it was so easy to do. You can do it by yourself at home. So this was the information I wanted to do. Now I didn't just listen to this video; I acted upon it. Then. My boss had got had had um, received a new camera as a birthday gift, so I borrowed the camera and then in the office now nah, I recorded a video sharp sharp. I read all the requirements. I'm gonna put the video somewhere. I'm going to play it. Probably I'll go on a commercial break and then I'll play it. So I'll put it somewhere. I'm not too sure how I'm gonna do it. So I did a recording with my phone. It wasn't too clear. Then I went for my boss's own. Did I did about three or four recordings of the US lottery. Then I shared the idea with a colleague of mine. This, she discouraged me, like she really discouraged me. She gave me points and reasons why I shouldn't go into such content because I have not won a lottery. I don't even know how the thing works. So why would I share something I don't have in-depth knowledge about to people? So it discouraged me, frankly speaking. I didn't go into it again. Fast forward to 2020, after the lockdown, one of my neighbors, and for my next door neighbor, he was he was like really in need of cash. He needed money for something urgently and needed to sell his iPhone, iPhone 8 Plus. Here is a iPhone 8 Plus, and the phone still looks new. Like, I mean, I keep things well. Oh, my phone is broken. Mm -hmm. So, there's the phone. Yeah, iPhone 8 Plus. <laughs> 2020, sorry, 2020, I got this phone. So, my phone is two years, you know. So you see why we are celebrating celebrating my phone my phone is two years no scratch on the screen or the back i keep things well okay so he needed this money urgently and i bought the phone and it was thanks to a friend a brother called mickey he pushed me and pushed me and pushed me to i uploaded my first video i've even gone that was diy family. so that was basically why i wanted to start youtube and it was to share the information okay it was just to share the information and that was it. <laughs> yeah, I mean it. <laughs> Guys, it hasn't been easy. Hey, it hasn't been easy. Like, you think it's so easy. Creating content in the first place is not easy. Talk off. <laughs> <laughs> being consistent okay so after i got the phone then i was like once i've gotten iphone me i'm only i'm not only coming to take pictures with iphone and post on instagram or nothing i have to start making money out of 
using an iPhone or start doing something with an iPhone, okay? With this iPhone that I got. So then the idea of going back to YouTube came into my head and I did a research, research, research and I said, okay, I want to do DIY. In fact, I had a lot of things I wanted to do. But from big YouTubers, they'll be like, focus on a particular niche. Focus on a particular niche. So me too, I focus on a particular niche. That's how I do DIY. I was focusing on a particular niche. Me now, I wasn't getting the finance that I need to do this DIY thing. But I love to do DIY. I love to create. If you know me, like, I would think of something like right now. Okay, and finances, my time was at that time when I started YouTube proper, proper. Time wasn't there, finance wasn't okay. Then I added the vlogs to it. Now, if you know me, like if you really know me, you know that I'm I'm not an outgoing person. But I was trying to move out of my comfort zone so I can, you know, make it. <laughs> so I started doing vlogs and I don't know what happened. I honestly don't know what happened with the vlogs because I have like so many content I want to create like I have listed all of them down but the movement moving to do it is a problem okay so that's just for the aspect of the content creating now my journey on YouTube as a starter trying to get people to subscribe to my channel it hasn't also not been easy you know me I'm not a slave queen I was not an Instagram person and so I don't have a lot of people on Instagram. Facebook, I think I was active then when I was in uni. I was active on Facebook more than on Instagram. Instagram, I go to watch people than to post. So I didn't have a lot of people following me on social media platforms. And I said, I want to do YouTube. I started and then I relied on my friends and family because, you know, I used to be a network market. And the first thing you you do if you join network marketing is they will tell you to list all your friends your family members and you start calling them one by one <laughs> so that was what i did i need not i i need not to call them because i had because of whatsapp you can just share your link to them i started my first video i shared it to so many people hey i'll go and check my subscribers and it'll be like 10 i'm like oh why are they not subscribing hey i say some of my close friends i have to take their phone and subscribe myself i don't like over a month or two or something they, they don't they don't have that time oh my sisters and brothers in the lord if you want to start youtube nobody cares about what you put out there unless it's of interest to them and we are taking advantage of that i joined um youtube groups on facebook there are 101 there are millions of youtube groups on on, on facebook okay there are one from nigeria ghana black american hey philippines i joined all of these people I was still not getting the subscribers so i researched i tried to find out new youtubers or small youtubers in ghana i found a number of them i created a whatsapp group they all joined and some of them to the glory of god they have 10k subscribers as of two years and i celebrate them so kindly congratulations and cheers to your achievements and youtube okay what we did was if you post a video you share the link in the group and every member is supposed to watch that video i mean like if, if you're trying to go that way you try and find your own way of trying to get people active in there so that's how we were able to i was able to get some more subscribers and i created that video and that also did not really get me to 1k i'm still in 200 so sometimes when you are not getting the views it will discourage you it, it will discourage you so remember what you like a car you feel like time to post or create content but if it happens that way my sister don't for those reasons say you're not gonna post videos please be posting the videos so with that said please let's go for a quick commercial break i'll be right back uh, 2021 baby right lottery which is currently going on because we are in october 2019 and it began on the 2nd of october so you can you still have the opportunity okay guys so we're back from the quick commercial break and um, that was me in 2019 trying to record a youtube video <laughs> it's 
that has been the journey so far moving on i'm gonna share my mistakes as a new youtuber with you because i think i'm still new i still have 200 subscribers i'm new and i'm only two years <laughs> so i'm not gonna take it serious and personal like that so one mistake i will, i i shouldn't have committed was to focus on a particular niche so i was not supposed to focus on just diy from the beginning because one i do not have enough time moving around or creating i could do a lot of set set, set up discussions so I could have taken advantage of that and do a lot of setup discussions. I could have shared information like I wanted to do before. I could have added it. I could have opened or spread my opportunities, opened my wings. Or how do you say it? And then create a lot of things, create a lot of content. Then per what my subscribers or my viewers will watch more or will comment more. That is when I have to focus on creating the niche i was not supposed to create just one and expect everybody to watch that no. that was my main mistake i believe that was the only mistake i did on youtube from the beginning you know i was advised though i didn't take it i thought i knew it all i thought mm -hmm. i knew it all and i also relied on my family and my people too much So going forward, what are you going to expect from Kisiwa? Okay. So guys, going forward, let me sit well. I need a drink to tell you about what I'm going to do from going forward. So going forward, <clears throat> it's like I'm going to start YouTube all over. But I'm not going to delete my videos. We are going to assume that I'm starting YouTube all over. I'm not going to focus on a particular niche. Anything that the spirit tells me, I'm going to produce and deliver. Oh, what do you think? Anything I think I can do well, I'm going to put it out here. Any information I think will be helpful to my viewers, I'm going to put it out there. Anything I want to document, anything about my life I think I want to document and save it for the future youtube is the best place for me to keep it so i'm going to put it here and that is practically the end of today's video well if you are a new subscriber and you've come this far guys i mean if you've watched this far if you've watched the video till so like right now oh please do me the other do me the honor by subscribing to the channel and click on the notification bell to get every video I post, guys. Because right now, hmm, I'm not going to talk, I'm not going to make any promises, but I'm trying my best. I will try my best to deliver, okay? <laughs> bye bye. Like this juice, I'm getting drunk.